With the Mario update coming to Animal Crossing soon, you'll get to transform your villager into the real hero of the Mario franchise, Wario. You can also transform your island into a Mario level with a whole host of other amazing stuff. So, as we're all obviously going to be jumping back onto the AC bandwagon, we thought it would be a good time to update you on the best hidden things that you can do in Animal Crossing that you might not know about. So number one, you can pull off some aquatic moves. The Animal Crossing New Horizon Festivale event introduced some new toe-tapping reactions, including an adorable dance move called Feeling It. But did you know you can also dance in the water? Thanks to the summer update that brought diving and swimming to our repertoires, you can take a dip in the ocean, and now you can even dance in the water too. In fact, you can use every reaction except sit down in the water. Just imagine the possibilities. I think it's definitely time to invite over a pal and pull off some of my very own synchronized swimming performances. You can grow lots and lots of bells on lucky horoscope days. So now on rare occasions when you start the game, there's a chance that Isabel will tell you she's read her horoscope and it just so happens to promise good luck. When this happens, players have discovered that you can make some serious bank. You can grow an Animal Crossing New Horizons money tree if you bury bells in a shiny spot on the ground. Players worked out that if you bury 99,000 bells on a day where Isabel tells you about a lucky horoscope, you can pocket yourself 297,000 bells when the tree grows in. We're glad that in some situations, believing in horoscopes can be a good thing. Why don't you let a dung beetle build your snowboy for you? As you may already know, if you've been diving into the wintry fun on your islands, building a perfect snowboy in Animal Crossing takes a bit of practice. Rolling snowballs to just the right size so the body can support the weight of the snowboy's head rewards you with some serious ice-themed goodies, and they're going to be going away soon, so you need to make the most of it now if you're interested. So, it's more than worth the effort to try and perfect your craft. The introduction of snowballs also invited dung beetle guests to the island, and, as it turns out, that might not have been a coincidence. These six-legged insects happen to be expert snowboy builders. As a player recently discovered, the dung beetles can help you create a perfect snowboy by rolling up the snowballs to just the right size. Yep, that's right, sometimes it really does pay to let dung beetles do their thing. It's worth noting that the beetles can roll the snowballs straight into the water, however, so that is something to watch out for. You can craft alongside a villager and it's super, super cute. Now, it's dangerous to craft alone, well, okay, maybe it's not, but it's certainly a lot more fun to craft alongside one of your adorable villagers. Recently, a player found out that you can actually use the same DIY table that a villager is using at the same time. So when you visit one of your villagers' homes and they happen to be whipping something up at a crafting table, you can make something right alongside them. It really is too cute to handle. So hopefully this has shown you a few new things to try out when you pick up Animal Crossing again with the Mario update. And for all the latest news on Animal Crossing, make sure you keep checking back in with GamesRadar. Thank you.